Every year, the Fort Meadow Reservoir is treated with an herbicide to kill off invasive species. This treatment happens each June, but it does not affect residents. We are treating the lake for two uh, invasive plants. One is the Eurasian water milfoil and the other is a fanwort. We've been treating for milfoil for the last uh, seven or eight years. Uh, this is the first time we'll be um, treating for fanwort, which is a new invasive that started to come in a couple years ago and now it's, it's starting to take off. So they have a new chemical that can treat that and we're trying that out uh, for the first time today. Although it does not seem eco-friendly to put chemicals in the water, it is the best option to keep our lakes usable. So there are other lakes and ponds that have not done treatment and in the end it just you, you just end up having the whole lake covered with this stuff and you can't boat, you can't swim, it, you just get tangled up in these weeds. So what we're finding now is that these invasives just have, they just have extra, they're just able to, to blossom and, and, and spread exponentially. You want plants in a, in a lake and you want a diversity of them because the fish need them, all the different bugs and everything that balances a lake out need, needs plants, but these particular plants are not useful for anything and they, they'll take over and then they just become a nuisance for boaters and swimmers and, and for the lake health in general. There is one way in which residents can help keep these invasive species at bay. Even if it's a kayak, a canoe, you really want to make sure there's nothing on your paddle, on your boats, on your motorboats, you have to make sure that there's nothing on the propeller, there's nothing in the well, the water well what, um, that, that's in the boats, um, the jet skis also, every, everything needs to be looked at to make sure that there's, there's none. The treatment happened on June 11th and the waters are now safe for users.